is a great teaching tool. It makes you appreciate people's individuality. And I think children can learn from this and you can turn it into a teaching lesson. It was a dynamic, fabulous, interesting show with tremendous themes. And I've actually brought my school groups to see this. Last year, we brought our students to the show. These kids come out of East New York and a little small school where dreams are deferred for them because maybe there's not a chance for the parent to actualize it. So these kids saw it and said, I can do this. Billy Elliot speaks to school groups because it allows them freedom to be who they are. It's something that's powerful for kids to know that they should do what's in their heart. The whole idea of falling in love with something and even though someone tells you it's not for you, to fight for what you want to do and, and really go for it. It's a timeless message. Let's just think about what the job, what the role really demands. We've been looking for a boy who can plausibly get into the Royal Ballet School. They need to have tap dancing, extraordinary contemporary dance skills, they need to have extraordinary gymnastic skills. On top of all that, they need to sing a number of Elton John ballads. It is an extraordinary burden to put on such little shoulders, and never before has anything been asked of a child to this degree within the theatre. You're pulling for everybody, basically. You're pulling for Mrs. Wilkinson, you're pulling for the father and the grandma is hilarious, and you're definitely pulling for Billy. And it's got every single emotion that you could hope to have. It was really funny, and the humor, it was just, I loved it. As a teacher, I look forward to bringing my students to this show. I want them to love Broadway. If I bring them to Billy Elliot, they'll be hooked forever.